Hi everyone, thank you for coming back here. The most awaited Android 8.0 update is finally there. They have announced it, released it and now we know the name. It's not Android Octopus like they teased earlier, it's Android Oreo. Let us get to know some of the cool new features of it. Oreos will be burning along with some sweet updates like faster speed, better battery life and more security. The first thing that you might ever notice is the colored dots above the app icon, which try to tell us that there are some Android notification on that app, which by the way is color coded depending upon the color of the app's icon. If you click and hold on the application's icon, it gives you a small preview of the latest notification. You can also turn off the dots in the home screen settings if you are not a big fan of it. With Oreo, you now have an option to change the shape of the icon, similar to the one you have been using in some customized version of Android from other companies. Picture in picture is one of the new features with Oreo, making it to float a snap of the app even when it is minimized. It's much more handier when making video calls. You can now use the instant app feature, which lets us to use the barebone versions of the application without even installing it in your device. The notification center has got a refreshed design, with finally able to see the battery percentage without pulling down the notification panel twice. There are a number of small new features to improve the fluidity of Oreo. So, a bit of a new look to the notification style. The one feature which I think is really useful is snooze notification option, which lets you to stop notifying from an application and you can also customize how long should it happen. Another really awesome feature with Oreo is smart text selection. So whenever you double tap or select a phone number, is you can see a phone app popping up letting you to make calls directly from Notepad or from wherever you select the text. So basically it recognizes what the text is and it's not only limited to the phone number, it also recognizes the addresses and pops up with the map application. And also there is a bunch of whole new emoji icons coming up with Oreo with awesome looks. Not only the app icons got updated, the settings app itself is updated. It's way more contents and way more categories and it's no more a huge long list. The battery settings has got updated with more polished and simple UI. Right away you can see the screen on time on the top and thanks for adding the toggle button to see the remaining percentage on the notification bar. The display setting has got a new nightlight and ambient display which shows the recent notification icons with much lesser power consumption. Back to the settings app with storage feature, you can free up space on a single tab. And also the smart storage feature which backs up photos to Google Photos, removing them off your actual device is much appreciated. Oreo now have Google Play Protect sort of an antivirus program for applications, gives a brief report on scanning specific apps for potential threat in your device. There's also a new look to the media controls in the notification. It actually takes the album art of whatever song you are playing and use it as a theme for that particular notification. And the autofill options is way more useful which fills out the credentials in the applications exactly similar to the one in the Google Chrome. So Android Oreo is expected to run on all compatible devices by the end of 2017 but there isn't any specific date from manufacturers when users will be receiving their updates. As I said before, I'll be ending with the Tirukural and here it is. Katradanal aya payanen kol valaravin natral tolar enin Which means, if you are the most educated person or the wisest man in the entire world and you are not worshipping or respecting your god, then your wisdom is of nothing. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and share with your friends and do subscribe for more such videos. That's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. Talk to you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.